Hi there! Today I'm going to talk to you about how you can find a VA even when you are on a tight budget. Now I have a Facebook group for business women from all over the world and when they enter the group they always need to let me know what is my biggest challenge in my business and this topic is one of the topics that I've seen so therefore I create a video about it. My name is Tineke Renser from Powerful Business Academy. I have 31 years of business experience of my own. I help business women to scale and grow their business and guarantee to help you double your income within a year for sure. Okay now what about finding a VA and hiring a VA. What do you need to look for? And especially when you are on a tight budget. So step number one, you always need to have someone where you can delegate tasks to. Even if you think that your business is too small, it's my firm advice to all of you out there, it's not sound to be willing to do everything on your own in your business because you cannot be an expert at everything. Running a business contains a couple of hundred different tasks and expertises. How can you even think you will be good at all of that? But when you believe that you need to do all of them because you have no money, then you're trapped. You're trapped within your business and I really hope it's not you and if it is you, please continue listening because I'm going to help you and give you advice on how to start outsourcing on a tight budget, okay? Step number two is go and look out on various platforms. So one of my favorite platforms is Fiverr, F-I-V-E-R-R.com. And there's hundreds or thousands of people from all over the world offering their services there. And you really need to be focused, otherwise you, you, you lose track of time because everything that you are doing now in your business, there are people who can do it for you. And that's a relief, but it can also be a burden because who do you choose and what do you outsource? So that's step number three or tip number three. Once you've found a couple of people that you think, hey, they match what I need and they do what I want, um, always negotiate about the rate. They won't do that at first and if you ask them how much do you charge, they will give you whatever they think they can ask. Um, but that doesn't mean that you need to pay that. I know for sure that you can find people for as little as $2.50 an hour. Two hours for five dollars. Now. Wouldn't that help you in your business just to release some of the daily tasks that you do yourself just for five dollars a day? Imagine that's only 25 a week. That little. Tip number four is I always ask a lot of questions when I start to engage with them, even in the first uh, conversation I have with them. And then one of the things I check for is how accurately do they answer my questions. So if, if I ask three questions and they only ask one and someone else answers two and someone else answers three, I am more likely to continue the conversation with the person who answers all my questions. Because that shows to me that they're engaged and that they're accurate. And I want someone who's accurate. I don't only want someone who's good at what they do. Tip five is always start with small tasks and easy tasks. The things that you can do with your eyes closed. Because then you know someone else can also do them. It's easy for you to explain how to do it and it's easy for them to learn the task. But it will help you, not initially because it always takes you time to teach them and train them, but after a couple of weeks it will. It will definitely help you get rid of a lot of overwhelm. Tip six is always hire a couple of people for the same task, three, four. It's a little more of an investment, but then you can compare the output. If you have given the same description, you can compare exactly what they have delivered to you. And then you know 
what, what, which person you like the best, who communicates the best, who works the fastest, who understands you the fastest, all these things are important, all right? So those are the tips, and there's a whole lot more I can tell you about uh, delegating, the interview, the contract, uh, creating systems, but that's not for now. Um, and to make delegating easier and safer, um, that's other videos, I've already created them. Go to my website, check my free menu and all my videos are there. Or go to my YouTube channel and subscribe to Powerful Business Academy and that's where you will also see the videos. Now, if you have a business to business service oriented business and you are still doing a lot on your own, then I have something for you. I do want to help you and I want you to be my next client because then I know for sure that you are going to double your business within a year. How cool is that? So what do you need to do for that? It's just schedule a quick 15 minute call with me. In these 15 minutes, I won't be selling you anything. It's just for us to check out uh, who are you, who am I? Uh, can I even help you? Can I uh, give you the promise? Uh, do you like me? And if so, we can always continue from there. It's just 15 minutes. You'll find the link underneath this video. I'm really looking forward to be able to help you and to help you scale and grow and double your business within a year. And next week, I'll be there with another video for business women on how to scale and grow your business. Bye bye. Thank you.